Hey guys, Joe the Auto Guy here today to show you how to super clean your windshield. This is Hey guys, Joe the Auto Guy here today to show you how to super clean your windshield. This windshield is actually really dirty, hasn't been through a car wash or anything. It may look pretty clear on camera, but it's dusty and dirty. Uh, to super clean a windshield, including polishing the glass, as uh, many of you asked me to show, um, you start off with a, an ammonia-free uh, glass cleaner, such as this, uh, this brand of Stoner. It's ammonia-free, has no other special soaps or anything in there that leave a residue on the windshield. Um, then next, to get really that deep scraping, you need a razor blade. Uh, one with the handles preferred, but I just had the regular razor blade today. Of course, paper towels or a lint-free microfiber. And today, to polish the glass, I'm using a Porta Cable DA polisher with a special glass polishing pad. It's a very thin pad. Also, uh, glass polish. There's a couple different brands. I use the ones from Griot's Garage. Not affiliated with them at all, but that's the ones I like. And uh, they're also the ones that actually supply the polishing pad. So the very first thing we're going to do... Give the windshield a light spray glass cleaner. Use a couple of paper towels to wipe it down. You can see how dirty it really is. Now we got kind of a good clean on it, but you can see there's still kind of some restriction when you pull back against your fingers. Um, that's because the glass can still have embedded dirt into it. It gets sl slightly etched and it'll actually hold on to dirt. So now that we've sprayed a basic clean off, we're going to give it another quick spray. This is where your razor blade comes in. If you listen, you can actually hear the dirt scraping out. So you actually just do the whole windshield safely keep your razor blade at a slight angle don't dig into it but just kind of do a light scraping on the outside I don't know if you can hear that so even though we just cleaned the windshield here's the blue Look at that little dirt line it leaves behind. You can see how much actually came out of the glass. We're just going to do the whole glass, whole windshield. So now that we've completed this step, we're again just going to take a couple paper towels and wipe it down. So now one of the reasons I actually chose this windshield for this video is you can actually see this small etch line going up across the glass. I can't guarantee that's going to be gone when we're done. But it'll definitely be less noticeable after the polish. This is when a rock gets caught and your wiper blade goes up repeatedly and scratches the crap out of your windshield. Okay, so now like I said, we're going to use the, I'm using my Porta Cable DA polisher to polish the glass actually. And this works well on very weathered glass where it still seems like there's stuff on the windshield and really it's nice and smooth. This will kind of get those imperfections out just like you're on your paint. Except uh, it's a lot harder and you use a lot more pressure than you would automotive paint. So like I said, I have the very thin uh, pad actually developed for glass polishing. Let me get some of the glass polish. I'll put a couple dabs on the pad. And you want to use not a lot, but enough to keep it. You're doing a whole windshield. Okay, 
Now we're going to pad. Just like you're doing paint, you don't want to throw it all over the place. Start on setting one. The one thing again, if you're using a polisher, you can do this by hand. But if you're using a power one, keep the cord over your shoulder. You don't want to be polishing your glass and then scratch your paint with the cord at the same time. So I'm going to start off with a speed setting one just to kind of mix the polish around. Okay, I'm going to start off with a speed setting one just to mix the polish around. We're going to move up to a high speed setting. Uh, this is kind of hard, so I'm going to spread it across the pad, really saturate the pad. Okay, so now that the windshield has been polished, again, we are going to clean off all the polish.
Okay, so now the outside of our window is super clean. And to look back on that scratch, like I said, there's no way to make it disappear, but I'll say it's less noticeable at a distance. So now what we're gonna do, is take a paper towel, spray on it, put your right, left hand onto the driver's seat and keep this hand flat. And this allows you to get the entire windshield in one swoop. And you can move up as you need to. To add a last finishing touch to the outside of your windshield, take a paper towel, spray some glass cleaner in it, and wipe your wiper blades down. Look at the amount of dirt. Just took off one blade. So that way your wiper blades are also clean, not spreading dirt across the windshield. So you can see the obvious conclusion to the process is you have a crystal clear windshield. You can do this to any of the exterior windows. It's great to make your car just look better, or if you're trying to sell your car, it's one of the best things that people look at is the windows. If they're clean, it makes the rest of the car look better. So that's how you do it. Hope this video helped you. And uh, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Yeah, I'm Joe the Other Guy. Thanks for watching this video. Hope it helped you. Please like and subscribe. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+, and my email's down below.